Today we're going to be talking about the Acme theme, what I think about it, my experiences, and my review overall. It's not too good, just to give you a heads up. Welcome everybody, my name is Kevin Smack, and today we're going to go over this theme that I purchased for my main site. I was very excited because I found one that would fit, and my main site is a little different than my other ones, so I need a little different of a theme to go with it. And I found one that should work perfectly, and let's talk about it. It was Acme Themes. Here is the website. I would log in. For some reason, my login no longer works. So right there, that's kind of a thing against them. They can't even log into their own site. <laughs> they have popular themes. The one that I wanted is the Super Mag. I did check a Zoic, and it looks like this theme does OK overall. So I figured it must be decently fast. I kind of like the look of it and I think it would go well with my site. So I ended up deciding to purchase it. So we went and purchased it. And how did it go? Well, we got the $55 one because I only wanted it for one site. All my other sites I use popcorn on and it works good. I just don't use it for my main site because popcorn doesn't really fit that template. However, I know they're coming out with a version later on that will, which I didn't know at this time. But with this said, it's $55 and it was $58.30 after everything. And I was considering it and, you know, the site looks pretty decent. You go down here, you see a 100% money back guarantee. That makes me say, OK, the, they must be legit. So let's go ahead and dive in. So I went, purchased it and was excited to give it a try. As I was setting it up, I was having problems. My footers weren't showing, and then they just completely disappeared. And then like the part under above that started disappearing. Like my pages were like disappearing and things were just getting crazy. Like it was ruining my website. I think I had it on maybe a half hour altogether trying to fix things. But as I tried to fix things, other things were breaking. The theme is a mess. Stay away unless you have, maybe if you have a minimalistic website, it might do okay. But for my site, it couldn't handle it. It was terrible. I had to reverse it, restore my site from saved because I couldn't even reactivate my old theme. It broke it that bad. It was bad. And I probably lost a good amount of money in that time because my site's pretty popular which stinks. And I did do the live preview and I got everything together where it needed to be. But at that point I had to see it to see if I can keep going. And it, it was just a mess. So I contacted them, said, I'm unhappy. I want a re refund. I see you have a hundred percent guarantee. That's why I went with it. And they're like, well, let us check into it. And I'm like, well, I can't reactivate it because if I reactivate it, it's going to break my site again. If I break my site again, I'm going to lose money. And I just restored it. So they're like, OK, let me send it to tier two. So they sent it to tier two and tier two is very helpful because I did not receive a single message after that. That was it. So their 100 percent guarantee is a joke. They're not going to give you your money back. And I hate companies like this. If you put that guarantee on there, come on, live up to it. You put it on there. You need to stand by it. Companies like this. They just shouldn't exist. But unfortunately, there's new companies popping up all over the place. Their numbers show they're high, but I have a feeling these are all fake. I could be wrong, but it just it just looks weird. A hundred percent customer satisfaction. Come on. Even if you're the best company in the world, you're not going to get a hundred percent. So this is a theme I would steer clear of for sure. Don't go near it. They pretty much will just leave you hanging, not give your money back. So how am I going to proceed? Well, I'm making this video to let people know not to buy it. So hopefully it does let people know and save money and give them less money. And I will write a review after that. And then when everything's said and done, I'm going to look into doing a chargeback on my card for it. I wish I would have went through PayPal. PayPal is so much easier to work with than banks nowadays. And I would have already had my money back. But because I did it through my bank, I'm going to have to go the old school route and do a chargeback. The good thing about chargebacks are it does charge them money, too. So they usually get hit with a $20 fee, plus they lose their money. And then I probably won't get my money back, but I'll have the satisfaction of knowing they don't 
have theirs either. I just noticed I had my gamer tag on the bottom of the video the whole time. Sorry about that. <laughs> it's gone now. So if you are looking for a theme, again, I always recommend popcorn. It's a great theme. Here's my playground website. You can see here I have the theme. It looks good. I like it a lot and I want to get it on my main site, but I'm going to wait because right now is when all the advertisers are bidding really well end of the year. And because of that, I don't want to mess up my ads on Azoic again because I did mess them up. If you're ever going to change your theme, you need to let Azoic know. Azoic has to go ahead and prepare it and then change it afterwards or it'll mess up your money. So know that if you're thinking of going with Azoic, make sure you find the theme you want first and you have everything set. That way you don't have to go through any more problems once you do sign up. If you're interested in popcorn theme, I do have a link down below. Use my code in the description. It will also give me a kickback and it'll give you some percentages off. I believe it's $20. So thanks so much for watching. If you have already got Acme, what is your experiences or popcorn? What are your experiences? Let me know them both down below. And I have to say this site, the speed went up a lot once I switched it over. All my errors pretty much went away from my old free theme. It really did well once I switched it over. So I'm glad I did that. I'm probably going to wait for the uh, caramel popcorn theme and use that for my other site once it is released. I'm excited for that. And I'm going to wait till January time. That way the ads are at the bottom and I could switch stuff over and not worry about losing much money. Thanks so much for the view. Maybe if you have a minimal. Maybe if you have a middle...